going to show you how to do these rounded over edges on your recesses for your speakers. The tools we're going to use are a round over bit. This goes in our router. I've already set up the router for the trimmer. It's just a small router. Got it all set, ready to go to the right depth. Earmuffs, dust mask, safety glasses, and an anti-slip mat. It stops our wood moving around so much that we don't have to clamp it down. Put on your dust mask. Make sure it fits snugly over your nose and securely seals around your mouth. Safety glasses and earmuffs. Just when we're routing, the router has a direction of rotation. When you're cutting with the router, go in the opposite direction of rotation. It cuts better and gives you more control. If you go in the direction of rotation, the router will want to go that way. It cuts okay, but it's made to go in the opposite direction. You'll get a better result. So my bit of wood's a bit thin, so my router bit just sticks out of the bottom. So it's going to hit the table, so I'm going to have to set it up a different way. So I've got some spacer pieces of wood. So this is how I do it. So if you're using thin material, you'll want to set it up in this way as well. So that's pretty stable there with the anti-slip mat. Without the anti-slip mat, there's a big difference. Okay, put my PPE on correctly. Make sure you put the power cable out of the way I like to put it over my shoulder just as long as it's out of the way of the cutter. So start it. Okay. Then push it to the edge of the hole. You hear it cut. And start cutting. Wait for it to stop. Then lay it securely on the table. So that's what it looks like once it's done. The speaker fits in the recess in the back and that's what it looks like. So that's the result we want.